Hey everyone, welcome to the Bruce Williams channel. Today we have another only episode where we explore the idea of only collecting from one brand. And if you were to build a three watch collection, which watches would you choose? I'm gonna give you guys my recommendations for what I think is a well-rounded, powerful rotation from only one brand. And today we're doing FC, Frederic Constant. Let me start off with a few notes here for those of you unfamiliar with this brand. The slogan is live your passion, which I think is pretty nice. It's a good slogan. The company was established in 1988. The name comes from a play off of the founders. There are two Danish founders, their own family names. So I've written them down here. Uh, we have Frederick Schreiner and Constant Stas. So that's where the name comes from. And a, a citizen acquired the company in 2016. They're still made in Switzerland. And they really focus in on that $1,000 up to the $5,000 price point. That's kind of their bread and butter. And they're more dressy, elegant watches, I guess you could say more dress styled or, or dress pieces. And I've got three picks that I'm really feeling good about. I, I like these picks and I want to hear your guys' opinions. And I'm going to start off with the heavy hitter, I believe, in terms of value, in terms of complication, and in terms of design. So this is the FC High Life Perpetual Calendar, retail price $9,000. $295. And I look at this and you might be thinking, holy cow, $9,000 for a Frederic Constant. You're crazy, Bruce. But hear me out, guys. Look at this. To my knowledge, this is the most affordable in-house perpetual calendar. Uh, you know, it's a grand complication. This is really impressive. You don't see this for south of five figures. So really, this is a value. You have a perpetual calendar. You have a moon phase. This is the FC775 movement, 26 joules, 38 hours of power reserve, 28,800 beats per hour. And I like the movement architecture. It looks pretty similar, at least the same platform as their other in-house designs. And I think it looks sharp and nice. I like the skeletonized rotor. I like the circular nature of the architecture. And again, this complication <laughs> you don't find at this price point. So I'm sure you could find a discount from an authorized dealer brand new. Frederic Constant, whether you agree with this or not, whether you love this brand or hate this brand, they have a, they don't have the best value retention. You can find some serious steals if you're shopping pre-owned. And I would expect that to be the case with this High Life, which is a recent release. So it might take a couple of years, but I'm, I'm predicting a market in which you can get an in-house perpetual calendar and a very attractive 41 millimeter case with an integrated bracelet, nice details for a steal of a deal pre-owned um, if you're into value shopping. So that's my first pick. This I think is what I would want to wear on a daily basis. Uh, and I like the blue dial the most personally, but there, there are a few co cool color options. Let's go to the next watch. This is the FC Slimline Moon Phase. I like the white dial or the light silver dial. I think it's uh, very, very elegant, very balanced when I'm looking at the dial, very simple, easy to read. This one comes on an alligator strap, 42 millimeters in diameter. So maybe a, just a bit too large for my liking. Uh, for this style of watch, but certainly not a deal breaker. And it would wear nicely. 30 meters of water resistance, an in-house movement, 26 joules, 42 hours of power reserve, four hertz beat frequency. And the retail price is $3,695, which for a pointer date and a moon phase with a genuine alligator band, pretty good value. Again, you're not going to be paying full retail price. You're going to be able to find a nice discount on a Frederic Constant. Hopefully I'm saying that properly. I, I know you guys are patient with me, but I'm terrible with pronunciation, even in the English language. So let's go to the last pick, guys. What am I going to choose? Uh, they don't really have a diver. I know I'm a sport watch guy, but I'd feel comfortable wearing the perpetual calendar on most days. Uh, so I want something that I could maybe travel with, use to a greater degree, um, and this is the FC Classic World Timer Manufacturer. So again, an in-house movement with 26 joules, 
38 hours of power reserve. This is the same platform that they work with this movement. And so this is a true world timer. And I think it's pretty impressive. And I like the depth and detail to the dial. I think you could really spend some time, especially with the loop, looking at the different elevations and finishes and colors. And I would likely go for the dark gray color because then I would have blue, I would have white or light silver, and then I'd have a dark color. And I think that would bring some nice variety. But retail price on this one, $4,195. And so uh, again, like I mentioned before, you're going to be able to get a nice discount. And for... <sighs> For a Swiss-made watch owned by Citizen, right? You're getting a lot here. <laughs> you're getting a perpetual calendar. You're getting a moon phase. You're getting a world timer. And it's not, you know, an ETA module or something like that. And it's not fifteen, twenty thousand dollars $20,000. This is sub $10,000 in each case. And it's a true in-house. I think that's really impressive. They're really bringing the value. Whether you love this brand or hate this brand, they are offering quite a bit. And they do specialize in that one to $5,000 price point. So lastly, just in closing, I reached out to Frederic Constant on Instagram and said, hey, I, I flexed a little bit. I said, hey, I run a channel of 70,000 subscribers. I'd love to borrow a piece. Would you be interested in letting me review one? And they said, you know what? We're interested. Email us and we'll let you know. So I've sent an email off to Frederic Constant. I hope to get some watches in to present in hand in person, show you guys the details, show you guys the in-house movements, and I'd love to get a high life. I really like this design and I think it's done really well. I like the size, I like the price point. If you don't want a perpetual calendar, you can get an open heart version or a chronometer three hand with a date sub 2000. And again, I think that's pretty awesome, pretty good value. So what do you guys think of my picks? What would you choose if you were only building a collection from Frederic Constant? I'm interested to hear. Thanks for watching. And if you guys have a request for a brand for next week's only episode, let me know in the comments. I'd be happy to try to accommodate if we haven't already done the brand. So, uh, so shout it out. Again, thanks for watching today. Hope you have a great day. I'll see you in the next video.